These are a, uh, a number of video clips we put together to give you an idea of uh, how the car looks when it's going down the uh, road and going down the freeway. Uh, as you see in this first uh, series of clips, uh, the car will handle three people, three uh, adults. And as we get further into the um, um, video clips, you'll see a lot of other things that are interesting. Uh, as you see now, we're, we're going up the freeway. Uh, that's here in Eugene, Oregon, and um, yeah, as you can see, the car the car is very very stable as you get down the freeway. It's very very fast. Um, actually, it's a lot of fun to drive. Um, the particular day we went out, what was it? Uh, here it wasn't raining, which is kind of unusual, but um, very very responsive, very fast. Um, um, in fact, it's very, very enjoyable to drive. At this point, um, the um, car that was um, filming this came up on me, and I motioned for them to roll the window down, and, and once they did, I uh, kind of told them I was going to leave them in the uh, background, so I just stepped on the gas, and away it went. And, uh, What's coming up is a uh, series of uh, interesting drives. Uh, I was going down one of the streets very close to the plant and going quite fast. And I'm demonstrating some uh, types of turns which um, we're going at a pretty fast speed. We must be doing 35, 40 miles an hour. And I'm, what I'm doing is I'm doing hairpin turns. And I, um, I, I would not attempt this in a conventional car. I got a, a BMW and I think I'd flip it, flip it over if I tried to move with uh, that particular car. Um, anybody that really gets in this and tries this car, uh, they get very, very hooked on it. It's, it's, a, it's a real joy to drive. Um, it doesn't feel like you're in a regular automobile. You feel like you've become part of the car. And uh, it, it's a very, very secure feeling, uh, surprisingly enough. Very unusual. The final part of this is uh, I'm heading at fairly high speed, uh, probably much faster than the, uh, the speed limit, which I shouldn't have been doing, but um, the uh, photographer was back there and uh, he was kind of prompting me along to see what would happen with the car. Anyway, we're heading back to the uh, shop at this point. Uh, I sure hope everybody enjoyed uh, watching this. Uh, we had a lot of fun making it. Um, I think we're going to really, really set the uh, automotive industry on the earth. Um, anybody that has seen the car in person, uh, anybody that has driven it, uh, becomes very, very excited. And this, is a, this is a real, real breakthrough on uh, automotive uh, design. I'd like to um, basically just thank all the people that have been watching this video. Um, you're going to find that uh, our company and, and our philosophy of what we're trying to do uh, is, is really something different. It's something you won't generally uh, find in the uh, automotive industry. Um, we're trying to build this in the United States. Um, we, we are looking at some areas to put plants in that will generate jobs. Uh, most of the uh, 
so-called competitors in this industry have all gone overseas. That's something that we, we really do not want to do. And with the right production methods and the right automation, uh, it really isn't necessary. Um, the new types of equipment and the new methods that have come out, the CNC machines, things of that nature, uh, make it um, competitive for us to build the component parts in this country and uh, then have everything assembled. Um, the larger companies have all opted to go offshore just because they're looking at the bottom line in the short term. Uh, we're looking at a long-term situation with this company. I think any of you that become involved are going to be very, very happy uh, uh, with the result. Um, I think we're going to make a lot of money together and, and we're going to do some nice things for the environment.